First tonight, the governor of Tennessee made several stops in the Tri-Cities to help welcome new businesses to the region. Thanks for joining us tonight at 5. I'm Sarah Diamond. And I'm Josh Smith. Governor Bill Lee, a businessman himself, put a lot of focus on boosting Tennessee's economy by bringing new companies to the state. Caitlin Cluck was there as the governor made his first stop today in Johnson City. Yeah, Governor Lee paid a visit here today to the new Lab Connect facility to cut the ribbon and celebrate the creation of over 200 new jobs. Right. Lab Connect, a central lab in the clinical research industry, relocated its Seattle headquarters to Johnson City. And in the era of COVID-19 and heightened interest in clinical trials, Tennessee leaders, including Governor Lee, celebrated its launch. And companies like this company step up and engage in, in uh, addressing a challenge that the entire world faces. Lab Connect's relocation from Washington to Tennessee was spurred by a tax break incentive package from the state, local governments, and the TVA. The project brings an investment of over eight and a half million dollars. As you can imagine, there's more um, focus on, on the healthcare industry and clinical trials than ever before. So we're certainly uh, excited to be part of this this industry and, and I think it's somewhat unique for for Eastern Tennessee. Lab Connect CEO Tom Selig said even before COVID-19 hit, the company focused on growing markets, cell and gene therapy, immuno oncology and rare and orphan diseases. Company executives gave the governor a facility tour and showed off the many aspects of the business, including lab kit building. It's all custom done. So basically every lab draw that you have, prepackaged materials, so we build about um, 25,000 of these a month mm -hmm. out of this facility here. Mm -hmm. Governor Lee said communities like Johnson City are important for the future of economic development in the state. As people learn that, that not everyone wants to live in the largest of cities and that there is a quality of life that's available in sophisticated smaller towns that have unique assets like this part of the state. Lab Connect CEO said today that over the next several years, they hope to double their number of employees in Tennessee as the company continues to grow. Live in Johnson City, Kaylin Cluck, News Channel 11. Kaylin, thanks. And Kaylin will join us live again at the top of the 6 o'clock newscast with more on Governor Bill Lee's visit to Northeast Tennessee.